and we're off. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your friendly commentator, the Ian Plays, or Esports Ian, or just Ian. How's it going, everyone? I am excited to be back. Guys, today we're here watching some Fortnite with Schmitty and Paparpapapanda. They are hopping into the Fortnite no build split. Number two. Ladies and gentlemen, looks like they're landing outside of Lustrous Lagoon over here. It's a nice stop outside the POI. There's a little pyramid back here. It's kind of Aztec-like. Uh, it's a great place to s drop. Not many people go there, so they'll get a good start and have some guns right off of spawn. Uh, Schmitty and Purple Panda looking like they are coming off of a victory royale. Got their crowns on, ready to go into this game. Uh, we apologize for no audio. We're on NDI right now. So it's looking like maybe one duo landing close to them. Maybe not in the exact location. Schmitty landing a little ways away. Purple Panda landing right on the pyramid. Schmitty going to start off with a rocket launcher. Switching over to the Paparpo Papanda. <laughs> Lots of basic stuff going on here. Purple Panda already having a sniper in his inventory, which is huge. Because we know how much he likes to snipe. And especially in a zero build game mode, it's just so much easier to hit headshots. Just going around looking for slurp barrels, trying to get all of the shields that they can get before they leave this POI. Purple Panda now deciding to take a prime shotgun. Instead, drops the sniper. I believe Schmitty is going to pick that up. No, Schmitty is sticking with the DMR. Mostly looking for enemies. They got a bounty that's nearby. I think they're just waiting for him to get closer and or farther away. They're deciding to leave. Saw some shots behind. Think they're going to ignore it. Looks like we are leaving the pyramid, going a little bit on the right side of Lustrous, or the top side. Excuse me. Hmm. And now it looks as if Schmitty is prioritizing shield bubbles, which is a good play with, with the no builds. Now switching to Purple Panda. Got some crash pads and still has an open slot looking for heals. 34 people remaining in this game. 
Not sure what we started off with. This is a custom lobby. Looks like we're making our way towards Sleepy Sound or whatever it's called now. Something sound. Going back over to Schmitty Cam. Getting some slurp barrels. Trying to get that full shield. Now going up top. Looks like they might be hitting the blimp. Quick loot up top first. Schmitty ready to hit the blimp. Going for it. Coming back down. Mostly looking for players. Sitting on top of the blimp. With his ranged DMR. Now jumping up again. Most likely going to come back down. Looks like they're just sitting up here as an advantage point. When he sees a stump, think it's a player. Does see a player. Marks it. Purple Panda already throwing shots out. Switching to Purple Panda Cam. Purple Panda throwing shots out with a hammer assault rifle. Hits one, 26. Not looking like they have enough ammo for these battles coming up here. Purple Panda absolutely lasering them from at least 200 meters away. Shmini's shots are a little behind. Purple Panda trying to trace them. Now they're in the storm. Going to hold in the storm for a little bit, try and get some extra pop shots while they're out in the open. Going to switch over to Shmini Cam. Another crash pad goes down. They're deciding to hit the launch pad, hit the tower. Try and make it back in a circle before losing too much damage. It looks like they're going to try and hit this other jump tower and get even further into the circle. There is one still blobbing on the ground. And there's another team under the bridge. Now at Chrome Crossroads. Looks like Schmini's wanting to hit another jump tower, trying to get a real location. Oh, Panda calls him back. Looks like Panda might see one. Thinking about pushing him. Switching to Panda Cam. Panda in the storm. Looks like he wants to hit this jump tower instead. Lands on top. Hits it again. See someone over at Black House, and or that might be where they're going. Panda's now going to drop over here by this dock on the outside of Tilton. Sees a rocket launcher. Doesn't want it. Gets some heals and some loot. DMR on the ground. Drops crash pads for some impulse nades. Back at a losing frenzy. Now just trying to get their heels back up. Sitting by the campfire. Schmitty's trying to get up. See some shots over in the south area. Find some chugs. I think they might finish off their heels right here. And they do. Both at 100, 100, 100, 150. Switching over to Schmitty Cam. Looks like they're hopping in the truck. Gonna look to go to circle here. Sees a team up ahead. Schmitty's throwing some shots. Hits his first one. 38 damage. They know where he's at. They might hop out. Nope, they're gonna stay in the truck. Purple Panda hops out. Now putting shots out. Schmitty gets the dock. And finishes off the first team. Schmitty with two eliminations coming in. Might have been a kill steal. Might not have been. I've played with both of them and they both are kill hungry.
This is looking like a good game. 26 left. Going in to the second circle. Might be third. It's a tree. Truck lost a tire. Schmitty sees another one in the distance by the tree. Decides to ignore it. Shots up ahead southwest. Purple Panda deciding to ignore it. Trying to go and find a good place to kind of stake out. Now going up to the blimp at Tilted. Vault already looted. I don't think that's what they're looking for. I think they're looking to fight here. Push it towards reality tree. Might actually be the move. Got teams to their left and their right. So why not just go down the middle? Switching over to purple pandas. Jumps the entire river. My goodness. Shots in reality. Caleb trying to see if he can hit any himself. Hits one. Just trying to hit a third party whenever they can. Caleb's looking at their back, looking at their backs. Now, once you go inside Reality Tree, you lose a lot of sight, so it is very difficult to fight in there. Just trying to get some extra ammo sitting around. Just like that. Makes it darker, a little harder to see. Schmini looks like he's already down there. Let's see what he's doing. No, he's already right behind Caleb. I see someone. Footsteps right on him. Could be underneath. It's a duo. Shwini gets scared, backs off, goes towards Caleb. Deciding to rotate towards the other team that's out in the open. Trying to get some loot while we're sitting at the house. Shwini's looking. Might see one. She sees shots over 206 meters away. One landing on them. Sees the duo, decides to run away. Caleb decides he wants to push that. So does Schmitty. Both hiding behind trees now. Getting that cover whenever they can. Not seeing the enemy anymore. 19 people left in the game. Right next to the fourth circle. Teen up. Teen up, folks. I'm hot. I'm steaming in this room. It's actually quite cool. Feels kind of nice. Shots west. Caleb looking to get some head advantage on the mushrooms. Sees a guy at 150. Oh, wait, excuse me. I'm a bit tired. It's already like 2 o'clock, though. Oh, and Caleb gets absolutely shredded. Schmitty knocks one. Dugun coming out. Caleb now trying to hit. The shield bubble comes down. In the shield bubble, trying to hit some shots outside. Caleb hits a 173. He's literally one shot and then gets the kill. Huge teamwork and a huge save from Schmitty with his DMR. Now looking to get some heals up before the next circle comes in and before the shield bubble runs out. Absolutely astonishing play. 
Those shield bubbles come in handy. You gotta hand it to him. You gotta. Trinity getting some quick heals off of the boing boing mushrooms. Looks like they're gonna look to this small gas station for some heals. Finds another person. It's a solo from before. Gets inside a car. Now they're gonna light it up, try and blow up the car. Runs out of ammo at just the right unfortunate time. Getting shot at from another team to the north. Esports, UJ Jimmy's looking like they're kind of stuck in this suitable area right here. Schmitty gets shot. Not sure from where. Shield cracked. Trying to hit these slurp barrels, get their health back up. Schmitty wanting Caleb, wanting Panda to get more of the heals. Because, well, kind of a goaded Fortnite player. Purple Panda has been here for a number of years, and he has been reliable and faithful to the Fortnite game for some time now. Schmini sees a team fighting up top, south, southeast. I'm going to switch over to Caleb Cam. Getting shot at. Shield bubble goes up. Holding the angle, waiting for one of them to push out. Throws another shield bubble so they can get closer. One decides to push in, throws a rocket at him. Only hits him for a little bit. The rock gets stopped. Schmitty now taking all of the damage. Is getting focused. Panda trying to push the outside to hit a clean shot. And gets knocked by the ranger. Schmitty now in there and gets killed with the rocket launcher. Sixth place. First game, an unfortunate turn of events. Nonetheless, very good. Schmitty three kills, Panda one. A good first round from UJ, landing at that small POA, POI, trying to get as much loot as they possibly can. I think it worked out for them quite well, at least for the first match. They are going to be sitting I don't know where they're going to be sitting, but it looks like Schmitty's trying to watch the game, see who gets first place. Go over to Schmitty Cam, unless he's still loading. Schmitty is watching. Maybe feeling skeptical. Oh, uh, big Rob with a snipe. Uh, the goo gun, overpowered. And the team that killed them just dies right away. That's how fast this game goes. Six people left in this round. Bush camping. I haven't seen this in a while. <laughs> since since chapter one anything. Big Rob now not hitting his shots as much. I am a yawn fest today. Big Rob sees someone trying to hit a shot desperately. Schmitty really wants to know who's going to win this. It looks like a 2v2 here at the end. One's pushing. Standing still. This is a weird play. Sees the player. Sees two of the players deciding not to shoot at him. Might have got the knock on one. This could be the last person. Decides to push? Absolutely crazy. Oh, shockwaves him into the storm. Storm doing 10 damage a tick. Wow.
Didn't reload his rocket launcher. And it looks like... Hitting the floss. Wow, this guy is really cool, huh? Looks like Skull Trooper will win the game. I thought I saw Alan Surish. Spish. Thrush. Something. I don't know. If anything, that was a great first game. I think, fundamentally, uh, UJ was just, had everything going for him. The, the shield bubbles are huge in the no-build game. If you have just even two of them on you, you could push a team. Like, what how they did, they had one bubble down, they were sitting in it, they were in a stallmate, and they were like, we're just going to throw one closer so we can get these guys and just, just be right on them. And it really worked out for them in the long run. Um, well, <laughs> sorry, it didn't work out for them. But that was a that was a big brain play. UJ knows how to keep their distance enough to where you can third party, but you won't be targeted, which is a great play. I was playing Fortnite right before I got on here and started casting. And man, I was doing the Fort Nightmares challenges. Whew. A lot of fun. Fortnite's been one of those games where you like go back to every now and then. And oh, today was the day. <laughs> uh. But looks like we're waiting here probably for another for another code or something like that. Schmitty now looking in the item shop. Maybe showing off his locker. While we're sitting here, I'm kind of just chilling out. Is there anyone in chat? Anyone who wants to talk to little old me? You don't have to, but I would, I would really, I would really appreciate it. What a paduka.
Yeah. Oh, looks like we're queued. 39 players. This is, if you think about it, this game is kind of self-explanatory. You don't really need casting, but I'm here for it. I'm here for your enjoyment. If I wasn't here, there wouldn't be any audio, and I think that would be 10 times more boring than me just sitting here and randomly talking whenever. But don't take my word for it. Take a word from our sponsors. Run an ad break. That'd be funny. Alright guys. Guys, answer this prediction. Answer this prediction poll. UJ is cool, yes or no? Answer it. UJ's cool, yes or no? Hear me out. Hear me out. I think yes. I'm literally going to go on my phone and answer this. I don't know where my phone is. I found it. I'm going to go on my phone and answer this question right now. Oh, there's a prediction. What is the max amount I can do? <laughs> I just did 1,300. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Let's go. Yo. Yo, the EM plays. Welcome to the chat. I'm literally talking to myself right now. Is that, bro? Am I weird? Am I weird, guys? If anyone else is in chat, please. Please talk to me, please. I don't want to be alone. I'm just trying to watch some Fortnite.
I think that was more of a question, not a prediction. But you know what? I don't care. I don't care, guys. We're starting off. We're starting off. It looks like UJ is going to an actual POI, POI this time. We're on Schmini Cam right now. I think we're gonna I think we're gonna change that. We're gonna change that. Because I do I do love Schmini Cam, but have you heard of a purple panda cam? Oh yeah. Here it is. Let's go! I'm excited for this game. Looks like we're landing at Greasy Grove. Been here since season one. Well, it went away and came back, but you know, we're we're here for it. Oh, Psych, I lied. They're landing at the barn behind Greasy Grove. Whack, goofy, uh. <laughs> Purple Panda now doing some Fortnite challenges by getting a bounty right away. Yeah. Here we are. Got the boys squatting up. Playing some Fortnite. Yeah, yeah. Shields in my hand. Drink it fast as I can. Gonna play some Fortnite. Get some cash. Yeah. I don't know. Guys. <laughs> I'm enjoying myself too much. My own presence. Oh, I'm such a I'm such a masochist. What is it called? When you're so full of yourself, like I like I love myself more than everyone else or something like that. I don't know. This is where I'm sitting right now. I don't I don't think it's a good mindset. <laughs> oh no. But I'm here for it, to be honest. So did I just lose all of my channel points? Be real. <laughs> Be real. Did I just lose all of my channel points? I just I just lost all my channel points. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I did a prediction and I lost all of my channel points. <laughs> That's so funny. I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb, dude. Oh my gosh. What did that do? I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. I was just messing with stuff. I deleted it. It's gone. It never happened, Chad. You didn't see anything. Don't tell my boss. I didn't do anything. I wasn't I wasn't doing anything. Wasn't trying to give myself channel points back or anything like that. All right, let's go back to Fortnite. I'm so sorry. <laughs> All right. Oh, man. So now that we're all looted up, first circle closing in. I did not see where their marker was, but they're going somewhere. So we're pretty far away.
going to synapse 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 something i don't remember what it's called synapse state or is state so in the early games of fortnite really truly all it is is just looting and maybe a few fights at the beginning but it's the entirety of fortnite is just looting so not much to commentate on but they're in circle they're ready for the next fight they're just waiting Fucking greasy grow or chance. Hop shots at a truck, the passing truck. Truck decides to run away because it's scared of this dynamic duo. Twenty seven people left in the game.
Shots all around DJ Esports right now. Now marking Purple Panda taking some shots over there. And kills one. Purple Panda with his first shield first kills, shooting people from a million miles away. Still whiting people. Might get this kill over here. Looking for the kill. They're both in the storm. Absolutely lasers the guy coming down. Has a port of bunker, bro? What? Shockwaves himself out. Has another one. Shockwaves again. <laughs> Purple Panda now getting hit by all of the animals in the whole lobby. Loses the guy they were focused on. I think the chicken was working for the guy. We just got absolutely shredded by P Purple Papanda. Sees the guy. Almost takes away his full shield. Might have launched Schmitty out of the way. They both look like they're going the same way. Now sees the guy. Has another one gliding in on him. Panda absolutely shredding the kids in the air. Sees him on the building. 21 left in the game. P Purple P Panda, one kill. Looks like Shmitty has one too. Might have missed back there. Yeah, he does. Shmitty now go in the roof. Sees the guy trying to get Caleb to laser him. Guy is in the corner. Shmitty now go in the corner. Guy's stuck. Panda might get the knock here. Panda gets absolutely shredded by him. <laughs> Looks like that might not have been the only guy. There's another team pushing towards. Schmitty. Oh, fundamentally trying to get him dead. Just got pinched by two teams right there at the end. Unfortunate for UJ Esports finishing 13th in their second game. Hmm, you really can't hear it, but I have music playing in the background, which is kind of sad that you can't hear it right now, but Guys, I'm going to be real. I'm about to click something, and I don't know what it does. So if it messes everything up, I'm going to go straight back to it, okay?
I see. I do like that music though. This isn't their last round rank. I'm just trying to get you guys to listen to some music. But I'll go back to it. It looks like this team is still pushing strong with 14 left. I do believe that Schmidt is just watching the games to see who they're playing against while Panda does all the technical stuff in the background with our esports coach, who is an immaculate guy if you ever meet him. He's my boss, so don't tell him I'm doing any of this stuff. I don't know if I'm allowed to do this, but a little self-plug is, uh, I got a show coming up here at the University of Jamestown. If you really want to see it, it is called Big Fish. It's a musical coming up. This week, November 3rd, 4th, and 5th, stop on by. Have a good time. It's a lot of fun. Uh, no, it'll be a really good show if you sincerely want to see it. But. Welcome back. <laughs> that rock is tumbling. I didn't know that was a thing. I thought that rock destroyed itself, at least in the past it did. The team that killed UJ Esports is looking really solid. So, it must have been a good fight. It must be a good team, is what I meant to say. Of course, Porta Bunkers would be and are absolutely huge for this game mode because it's literally builds. Outside of build game mode. Oh, that's how I get my stuff back. Did I just give Sarah Bears Are Deadly like a thousand, a thousand channel points? I might have just done that. <laughs> Oops. Infinite, infinite channel point glitch. This team, and they win the whole thing. I mean,. It's got to be got to be pretty solid. Pretty solid for UJ to even put up a good fight with them. What is this emote? Is that the Monster Mash, the new one? 
They did the monster mash. Oh, this guy might be doing the monster Oh, no, that's Rolly. I already got some designer to hold up my pants. I just want some ice on my wrist so I look better when I dance. You look, I see, I put you in a trance. You know what I'm saying? Chat, if you know what I'm saying. Ah, 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 ah. Anyways. Round two. 13th place. First round, 6th place. It looks like the first round was a warm-up for everyone else. But. UJ Esports. Who is already very warm. Might be on the downfall. But I don't believe that's the case. I think UJ Esports is going to bring it back this game. Now waiting to get the code in for the next game. So with that last round. I'm not really sure how to change this. <gasps> I figured it out. Guys, I figured it out. <laughs> they got 13th place. Shoot. 13th place. I do believe. So, right now, we are waiting for the next round. This isn't last round rankings. This is just previous round ranking. So, we'll change that. We'll change that right now. Don't yell at me if I spelled previous wrong, because I probably did. Guys, while we're sitting here, donations, follows, likes. I don't think you can like on Twitch. That just bits. Give me the bits. I want. I want all the bits. It all helps. We appreciate all of you being here. Just, just being with us, you know. Really want this music goes hard. Chad, I'm not gonna lie, this music goes hard. Yeah. I like it a lot. Did I spell previous wrong? Does anyone know? Previous. I did spell it right. I'm a genius.
We are still waiting on that third lobby code. The duality of Fortnite. Looks like we just got the third code. We'll be entering that in. Pretty soon here. All right, looks like we are starting up here. Apologies. Put that music in the background. I'll have a little something to listen to. Mm -mm. All right, round three for the Jimmies. Let's get going. I'm excited. I'm excited for round three. I think they we know what's happening. We just need to come together as a team, focus on one guy at a time, hit some pop shots in the distance, and overall you're just messing with everyone's mental. I think it'll it'll work great. Purple Panda sitting with 3,000 V-Bucks. Oh my gosh. It's insane. I can tell you, my V-Bucks look more like Schmitty's. <laughs> yeah, that's about where mine sits. <laughs> so, we are waiting to start this lobby, so just enjoy some music. All right, ladies and gentlemen. We 
we are starting round two. Round three. Three. Round three, baby. <sighs> three o'clock on a Saturday. We're starting round three in Fortnite. Okay, look at the battle bus. Like, dude, come on. Fortnite. Fortnite Mares update always always is super cool and I'm yawning because I'm tired and stuff <laughs> okay looks like we're going back to the pyramid in the back back top right I should say of lustrous this contrail is hurting my eyes purple panda oh my goodness what a schmitty got much better it was just all in my face. It was like, ah, ah, ah. You know? Chat, I've never messed with a blue Yeti before, but there's one sitting right in front of me, and I am very much enjoying it. All right, Lenny at that back pyramid again is the first, same as the first round. This is a good drop. I I do I do agree with UJ on this play. Again, getting as much shield as they possibly can. Already two minutes into this game and they had a decent setup, not gonna lie. Panda, excuse me, Panda always preferring hammer over dmr when the dmr first came out there's a little head glitch that you could do behind a ramp where you could aim and then your head just wouldn't be showing and that was a broken glitch but i think shwitty still prefers the dmr it's just a nice long distance kind of thing you know showing off their emotes when you get the rolly, Panda says no. <laughs> Looking for a free key buy here. Of course, going for the hammer. Why not? About three minutes into the game, 39 left. Panda already got his gold hammer. I think the music is much better. If anyone else wants to comment on it, please do. But you don't have to. Couple of boys getting some toys from TJ Maxx. Uh, get some new slacks. I don't know. Not much that runs with Max, except everything, you know. Mm, you know what I could have done? Could have been like two boys getting some toys, going to TJ Maxx, 
No, I'm just kidding. Getting some Big Macs. Guys, follow me on on SoundCloud. Uh, not sure I see, like, what's going on here. A little dance-off while they wait. No. No, 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 I know exactly. Okay. Purple Pan is going to give me an aneurysm. Oh, my God. I couldn't tell you what's going on if I tried. Just, just emoting. Jeez, Louise. Anyone here played Zelda? Huge. Fun game for me. sure what they're looking for here they're kind of just chilling out waiting for the next storm circle probably waiting for people to push them This is absolutely crazy. Purple Panda and Schmitty now testing out their parkour skills. Absolutely going insane. Using the crouch. Now, looking at Luxurious Lagoon. They have the circle once again. Now parkouring. <clears throat> Purple Panda, looking for his next emote. Finds a spray. Looking for a good spray. Showing off his entire emote set. There's a dead guy on the ground. What do we do about it? He stomped him. <laughs> no, no, no. Why are we here, guys? Why do why do we watch Fortnite? Why do we watch this game play? There's a car on them. Finally. Get some action. God. Only one squad has died, by the way. Just want to let you guys know that. Only one squad has died.
finally getting some action. I mean, we were sitting there emoting for the entirety of the first half of this game. I mean, <laughs> they're entertaining the stream for me. That's all. That's all I care about. Oh man, I got the yards again, dude. What's going on? Panda now looking for a team here. I, I, I mean, that's all you can do. Thirty-seven left. Only one squad has died. Only one duo, I should say. Finally seeing some people. Throwing a shield bubble down, getting that extra cover, trying to push towards them. Gets shot from the tree on the left, finds the rock to get extra cover. Schwinny now shooting the tree down. Purple Panda with a launch pad, trying to see if he can find anywhere to place it down. Schwinny throws the bubble onto the tree that he was on he decides to impulse away he's in the bush trying to f hide away from all of his shots gets hit by a purple panda once wondering if he's a solo looks behind trying to see if there's another guy behind the other guy is not here might be solo Oh my God. <sighs> Knocked down. Absolute huge play from Purple Panda. Truck now pushing up on him. It looks like an entire duo. As in two people. Rocket Launcher misses. Caleb hits a 128 with the Ranger. Now pushing him. Gets the kill. Finishes him off. Schmidt getting the other kill. Another one gliding in on them. Now finally gets some action. 28 people left in the game. Looks like close to last circle. <sighs> people now surrounding them. They're in the middle. Guy impulses, hiding in the bush over there. Purple Panda trying to get some shots. Sees him behind the tree, hits him at least twice. UJ hitting the rift. Probably gonna land on this solo. Looks like they're already getting landed on by another team. They're going to back out of there. Trying to get some high ground over here. Sees a duo and or two solos. Panda deciding to full send this. Schmini already fighting. Gets knocked down. I got the hiccups. Purple Panda gets one knocked. Misses the goose to the right. Purple Panda just trying to get the elimination to get some extra points and gets eliminated 13th place again. UJ getting 13th place once again being eliminated by Famous Ben.
while Schmitty spectates, Caleb's tallying up all the points. Purple Panda, apologies. Um, but I do gotta head out here soon. I love each and every one of you dearly. Uh, there might be one more game. I'm not sure. I think this is five games they play. Um, but let's check in on over here. Both spectating right now. So we'll see how that goes. I will be right back.
Schmitty now deciding if he wants to buy anything. Finds out he has zero dollars in his bank account. Okay, we're back. I'm here with my co-caster. Uh, Sarah Bears are no, deadly. <laughs> that is my Twitch name, in fact, but my gamer tag is J Drizzy Drip Drip. Full seriousness. <laughs> All right, <laughs> we're here in the studio. All right, so Jimmy's got third place again this round. I believe thirteenth place was the thirteenth. There we go. Mm -hmm. Schmitty now trying to show off how much money he spent on the game. <laughs> A lot of battle pass stuff looking right here. <laughs> oh my gosh. Classic, classic. Looks like they're both looking for new skins to wear. But they're but... keeping the color in check. Both got that same purple pinkish hue to it. I like it. Thrilling gameplay right now. Thrilling. This is about how it goes, to be honest. Mm, mm. But Shmini's talking in party channel. No clue why. Uh, I believe a friend of his tried to get him to play a game. I see. Also, Co-Caster Ian couldn't help but overhear that you were having to do a shameless plug earlier for <laughs> next week. UJ students, if you haven't heard once, you'll hear it again. Big Fish, classical musical, man right here, Big Eye. He's actually the lead. Stop Done very it. well. He's Stop doing it. great. Stop it. No, no, you've actually been doing a very good job. Thank you. Working hard and it shows very much. Uh, if you would love to see some fellow esports people on the stage, November 4th through the 6th at the UJ Ryland Auditorium. 3rd through the 5th. 3rd through the 5th. My bad, my bad. 3rd through the 5th, 7.30. UJ students and faculty get in for free. If you're interested. <laughs> One of our uh, Fortnite players is calling me. I'm going to mute up real quick. Really tried to leak his account. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> what is he doing? Such a was, what's the word? Philanthropic move right there. Wanna give V Bucks to the people. Oh my goodness. Who who am I supposed to go to here? <laughs> Caleb's on his per, Panda's on his Discord. And oh okay. okay. <laughs> I can't with these players. I think we might have gotten the code for the fourth game. Mm. Yes, we did. Perfect. So, last game, 13th. First game, sixth place. Trying mm. to look for at least a replication on that. And as I've been noticing, they got they definitely have the better skill set, I would say, of what we've seen so far. So honestly, it's just been more like they what they really need is just like more of a distanced approach. Yes. Get some DMRs or some sni heavy snipers and they should be good to go. I think if Schmitty, I think if Schmitty just keeps trying to get a DMR, he'll actually 
do pretty decent. I don't think last game he picked up a DMR, which might have been his downfall. Mm. But once Panda gets a hammer assault rifle in his hands, goes crazy. Once he got that gold assault rifle, the gold hammer, a few mm. games back, he was just lasering kids while they were flying in the air and just getting hit by impulse nades and the, he was just following them and tracing them. It was, it was great. Absolutely. 29 queued. I think they're supposed to be 39 or 40. Yeah, so we're still missing a little bit of a chunk, but I think it gives the players some more time to reconvene, go over strategy. 100%. I was talking about how I played the game right before I started streaming and I was literally only working on Fortnite Mare challenges mm. because I very much enjoy when Fortnite does their holiday specials, especially when Christmas comes around, they always got something awesome planned out and the presents come back and the game modes, the snowball launcher comes back and the... And the snowmen outfit comes back. It's just, mm -hmm. it's just a lot of fun, and that's a core memory for me from like season five, with all my friends on Christmas break, like in high school. Yep, I would say the same. It really is tis the season when you're playing around that time. Mm -hmm. I still remember sitting at my kitchen table with my gaming laptop, just opening all the Christmas presents you get once a day. Oh, the Christmas presents. Really? I forgot about that. It's just, it, that's my Christmas countdown. You know, like one of those advent calendars. Yeah. Just bought a pack. <laughs> <laughs> Schmitty is informing me that he just bought a pack because I said he didn't have any money. But he still has zero V-Bucks in his account. Yes, unfortunately. But I can't say much because... I'm the kind of guy that's like, buy the battle pass, get the V-Bucks to the next battle pass, and then yep. whatever's extra, buy in the item shop. Occasional, occasional impulse buy though. Like when Tom Holland's oh, uh, Spider-Man Spider came out for No Way Home. Did I was you like, also get the uh, MJ skin? Yeah, well? I got the bundle. Yep. I, I, I was like, I, I got it. That was me with the, the arcane pack that they brought out, but I, mm. specifically the Jinx one. That mm -hmm. was... Still a mm -hmm. phenomenal show. I'm just waiting for the gritty to get back in the item shop. Yep. They I did do the it. yeah that, that whole dance special for a hot minute. Oh. Yep. Schmitty showing how much money he spent on the game actually. Oh, well, speaking of which, there's the gritty. No, no, he just flexed the gritty on me. And the train. I do like that emote. What's the, uh, uh, what's his name in Fortnite? Uh. Is it shoot me? me? That is his name. Shoot me. C H U T E M I. Yep. Uh, he has the Meow Skulls uh, tune version. And uh, he has this emote and the Meow Skulls specific one. And I very much enjoy it. I believe it's based off of Inky. Uh, yeah, Inky and the. And that something something machine. machine yeah it's just the ink machine yeah the, the, that was a little after my time when i got into youtube gaming i'm not gonna lie <laughs> yeah. to you i i it was bendy bendy in the ink machine there bendy we go in the ink machine yeah 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 i enjoyed that i i watched youtubers play and i thought it was a really bad game at the beginning but then i was like oh my god this actually has like a plot yeah the, i feel like that's like a lot of like the indie Developers recently have been mm -hmm. doing like episodic releases of their games, mm -hmm. which honestly, it's like because they're usually a one or two person team, it would make sense. Right, especially with uh, Poppy, Poppy oh, Playtime. Absolutely. I think they just came out with Chapter Two. The... They're coming out with Chapter Three, actually. Yeah, I was gonna say yeah. Chapter Three is uh, up and coming, but yeah, like I said, getting a little old. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> See like, oh, up. Will yeah. Purple Panda join the train? We will find out. Yes, we got a caboose. I remember when this was huge and the entire like pregame lobbies would like just use this. 
and you have a huge train. I was talking about the battle bus look earlier. Oh, I love the look of it. I remember I was zoomed in one time and I didn't see it, but it got love the festivities. Sometimes I just look at it and then I forget that we're dropping and then I'll AFK drop and I'll be like, oh crap. <laughs> Oopsie. It's still partying in the battle bus. Everyone's gotta know. The, the lights are still rolling in the, what? A rift was already hit? In the middle of the map? Huh? That must be a glitch. I would assume so. It looks like UJ's going to the same spot for the third time in a row. Well, you know, if you practice hard enough and it's a spot you have good luck in, then I don't see why not. I think mostly they just push here because literally no one goes here, and we appreciate that. Not sure what's happening with mm. purple panda screen right now. Let's see if I could fix that. No. His screen is kind of so out. small. Looks like we're watching Schmitty Cam for this game. With the skin he splurged on, probably. <laughs> Most likely. I don't see Schmitty as a big. Yep. I don't see Schmitty as a big ranger guy. I don't really know many people who are, to be honest. Uh, well, I actually, Purple Panda. Be. If he had to choose between Ranger and anything else, he'd choose Ranger. But Hammer, Hammer really is the superior AR rifle in this game. Hundred percent. A lot of people go for Evil Chrome, but I, I don't like the burst. I never have. Yeah, the burst isn't my cup of tea either. But uh, the Evo shotgun, I would say, is pretty good. Yes, the fire rate. Oh my, the mm. fire rate on the Evo shotgun is absolutely insane. But I, I, do I would say the reload. The, the reload is one of the issues with that, especially after you level it up. I do. I, yeah, hundred <laughs> percent. You would think if it, you leveled up, it would be easier to reload. But, mm -hmm. You know. Um. But yeah, I, I am like Schmitty. I prefer this. This loadout looks pretty good right now. Mm -hmm. Pick up the shockwaves, hundred percent. Nope. Wonder if the. I'm sure Panda's selling anything good. Up. Nope. Uh, still a little buggy, but you can get a good eye on his loadout. It doesn't look too bad. Got good range of everything, and got a key. Two keys, actually. That'll be good for later on if he wants to get another gold hammer by chance. And or a vault. I haven't seen him hit a vault yet, but then again, that's a very populated area. Yeah, and the last thing you want is to get stuck up there, and then if you have to fly away, you don't want someone shooting you at the sky. 100%. And I know everyone is trying to play very conservative here because this is the last game, last round. Mm-hmm. Purple Panda taking Schwindy's loot. <laughs> <laughs> There's not much, and I've said this like four times. There's not much to commentate on in the beginning rounds, like in the beginning, at least for the first few circles, because it's all just loot. Yeah, and that's why I was telling Coach you need a second commentator to keep it interesting. That is true. That is true. That's why we're here. I mean, I mean while we are here and there's not much going on, and uh, Ian plays. I believe, like, we've talked about this before, but what is your opinion on zero build over build? Ooh. So, I I think personally, it's the game mode that everyone wanted, and then once we got it, it was like half and half. Mm. Because obviously, there's people who literally base their entire gameplay off of building, and they can't do anything else. Right. And then there's people that actually use the fundamentals of shooting and they can actually like hit shots. Like, for example, Purple Panda, when he literally traces people and hits all their shots. Looks like there was a llama up here. Schmitty getting all the free ammo. There we go. Um, but yeah, no, with the zero build, I think it's much more tactical. You gotta, mm -hmm. you gotta actually hit your shots or else you won't win yeah. but it's just a nice 
it's a nice breath of fresh air for Looks people like... who are so used to builds. We have a lot of chests. I wonder if there's a vault down there that they could get to or if it's just a normal scanner. No, it looks like a vault. Doesn't look too populated, especially since it's not one in the air, so good opportunity. Schmitty looks like he really wants to get into that <laughs> vault. Like, really wants to get in. Default dancing well kind of secures the vault. I think this would have... Mm. I was going to say, I think this would have been a good place to drop, but obviously you can't get in unless you... You have those keys. Got the keys. I believe there's like at least one key per area minimum, but... Yeah. Still, you don't want to do anything and on assumptions. Schmitty already has two keys back from one chest. Yeah. So they could literally go to another spot. Now having his AR ammo. Schmini, because he has all the ammo in the game, is splitting it with Caleb. Oh, and the storm's on their way. They got a few rifts right here. Look at that. Beautiful. This won't take them all the way to circle, I believe, though, so they're going to have to find a blimp nearby. I mean, they, if they fly straight towards that tornado, there, it's a good chance they can do it, but it is a little risky if you're still stuck in the same place. Mm -hmm. Oh, nope. Here's oh, circle. Perfect. He's bugging out with his movement a little bit here. Let's see if it fixed itself. It might be a, a sender problem instead of a receiver. Might be something wrong with Purple Panda's recording software right now. Well, going back to Schmini. Trying to get some coconuts and get those heels right before the storm and or someone else pulls up. There's a campfire right here. It would have been a good opportunity to get one of those uh, four nightmare challenges done. If they haven't done so already. 100%. Dancing in the nighttime. By a campfire, yes sir. Did you know you could do that in the... In like those spooky like grim yeah. gables and yep. That's how I figured it out. I didn't know that until I was like, wait a second. I'm gonna try it at least. It looks like they're taking the tornado. Hopefully they don't get easily spotted. It looks like he's trying to go in the tornado a bit to conceal himself, which is a smart move. That is kind of mesmerizing though. Mm. Just another lucid dream, you know? <laughs> I'll be honest, I never even realized you could just kind of hover there. Yeah. If it wasn't in the out of circle, it would have been a game winning strat. No, seriously. I'm trying to decide where to go here. They both have keys. Yeah, I would yep. say go to vault. If they get there first and don't get followed soon after, I'd say it's risky, but if they get any more gold weapons on both sides, it'd be worth the risk, I would say. Yeah, I think they should go for Vault here. But they are trying to play very conservative, so... That Vault could already be looted. Looks like they're just sitting here waiting for Circle, at least. bounty expired unfortunately but again like i said game running strat it sounds like they're taking my advice <laughs> and schmitty's having a good old time so, sorry for those who have motion sickness schmitty trying to give us sickness uh, but this i, I wouldn't say this, this makes me better. sick but maybe a little just do nothing oh well maybe that wasn't the... oh, there we go yeah those work looks like he's chilled out a bit This is such hype music for what's going on right now. 
Absolutely. I mean, I believe I overheard them say that they were going for a more conservative approach, like I was assuming earlier, but Storm's right behind him. Looks like it's time to move. Curious to know if anyone ever goes for the bosses during a competitive, at least if they're all loaded up on ammo. I'm not sure. I don't know if it would be worth it. it was Especially just... like if something goes wrong and you and get, get third party. But... Ooh, an unopened vault. Very nice, especially it's actually for two Because they might get more. Shreddy might get a golden loadout, and then. That and would then. be the ideal for all of them. Looks like there's already a gold rapid. That's. I would say that is one of the best things you can have during a competitive. 100%. If you're trying to just laser kids, even with the small amount of damage it puts out, it really racks up with its fire rate yep and as i was talking to purple panda i remember the rapper was hard for me because i wouldn't say i'm pro but do play a lot and he says it is a really good gun for those who know how to control their aim mm -hmm. now finally seeing someone gliding right next to schmitty doesn't see him they're on top oh, of the blimp that's an interesting play looks like they just jumped off might be a schmitty trying bit of to touch follow him. Tiptoeing around. The other one just comes up as well. Ooh, Panda, Panda down. Fortunately, looks he got. Yep, he fell from the top of the balloon. Unfortunate. I can guess his reaction. I'm not gonna lie. I I can also hear it. Unfortunately, looks like Schmitty is looking to leave him. I believe Panda probably told him that. Not worth the revive. Or maybe he's trying to throw him off by going to this blimp and then going back. Could be. I'm surprised they haven't stormed Panda already. It looks like they probably still stayed over there. Not sure if I like this play. Slowly gliding down. I'm not sure either. If someone just had really good sniper and good aim, it would be one shot and then jimmy's would be over but we'll have to have faith in our team now it's another waiting game it looks like even without purple pandas reboot car looks like it's just gonna be schmitty soloing for now Especially with 31 people left in the game. Yeah, that's not the best. I can 100% see Schmitty just kind of playing it cool for now and letting the other teams duke it out. Oh. May not be the most... Would you say it's an honorable play or the smartest play? Oh, and we Honestly, got company. I would have went for my teammate. I would have found a way. True. Maybe he's deciding to dip, but they might be following him. Nope, they're underneath. Uh, hopefully they don't start shooting upwards. Mm -hmm. Yep, looks like someone else just got rebooted. Not good. There's a tree. It's still surprised I see some trees lying around. Yeah, especially the big ones. Yeah, because I believe you can de-weed them or whatnot, but I don't think that you can really get any more ammo from them. Mm -hmm. Zombie chicken pushing towards Schmitty. I was talking about it a few, I think it was two games ago now, but the the animals looked like they were just against I was UJ. I was noticing that a lot just it was always and it was always panda too not even mm -hmm. Schmitty I'm sure panda was very excited about it oh wow look at that the numbers already down to 22 almost 10 down from what we just noticed so 
Especially with these circles getting smaller, it's going to start dropping very It looks like quick. Schmitty may have gotten noticed, or nope, they're just trying to get some ammo, get out of there. Smart move, yeah, just leave them be. So what you're seeing right now around here is the visual sound effects, and Schmitty is crouched right now, so his footsteps weren't noticed at the time, but now obviously shooting at them changes the entire play. Shreddy looks like he's going to try and rotate on the entirely opposite side of the map. He is currently getting shot at, I would say. Safe move is just to go inside a building. Maybe not camp it out, but at least try and let other teams get distracted by other teams. That and maybe look for some heals around. Oh, well, I see a fruit box. I don't know if he's going to go into that. Oh, no, it's just he needs some shields. That's what he needs. You can get the shield mushrooms from the fruit boxes. Oh, that is true. Looks like Shmitty's not really willing to get close to any windows as of right now. No, I think what he's going to try and do is at least make it to a top top two situation, you know? Yep. Ollie, I believe if all he did was touch the wall, he should still barely be within circle. I don't know. Hmm. I think he has to go more to his left. He has to go, like, in the corner. Hmm. Oh, I have been yawning all day. Yeah, it's looking like team is right on him. At least two teams. Mm -hmm. Two trying to run away. Victory crown now oh, down. Oh, he's stepping out. Oh, they were on top of him. They jumped down. Rocket launcher. Not sure what that was going to do. Hit to 113. Oh. They placed... Two places higher than their last two games, which I would say any improvement is a good improvement. They really did play their hearts out. They did. Indeed. My goodness, I cannot. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Fin. Uh, for those who can't see right now, uh, Ian just spelled final, but switched the A and the. It's fine. And around, but we got it fixed. It's fine, guys. Well, I think we're gonna calculate some scores here. Yeah, I think Schmitty is going into a replay of sorts. I think he wants to see what happened. Which part they're curious about, I, I am not 100% sure. Probably just maybe wanting to see where those duos were at when they shot him down to 50 HP. I think he's trying to see what happened to Panda uh, yeah. when he got knocked. Uh, yeah, I, they're probably... Just wondering. That was a good spot. Mm -hmm. Okay. And it hits his glider. Going back up the chute. Okay. So. Still on his glider. So he touches the balloon, stays in there. That guy hits in. it. Oh, yeah. It and is a very knocked. finicky control that happens. If you and say you and your friend are trying to jump into a balloon at the same time, one of you knocks into the other, you're still stuck on the bottom, but he's flying. I guess if it's the opposite, yep. that can happen. So that was just an unfortunate event that tends to, that just kind of happens with the air balloons this mm. season. Yeah. But I honestly, don't know what the final rank is going to be. Look at all the players in the bottom right. Absolutely. Just all in the, they're all in the one circle. Some people don't even know that there's like three on top of them. Like over here, there's like six people in that bottom left corner. All probably on different floors are already having yeah. a battle. Shmini hits it. Oof. Looks like he wasn't even looking at him. But he hit a headshot. 
Schmitty now closing Fortnite. <laughs> Absolutely done with the game. Shutting down his PC entirely. Um, not sure where the University of Jamestown stands. Right here. Oh, no. It's gone. Well, that'll be it. Yeah. They're all closing down their stuff. So, I guess we're going to be done too. But, thank you guys so much for watching. Appreciate you being here. Absolutely. You're the best around. Nothing's ever going to bring you down. And, uh, we hope to see you next time. Uh, I do believe that in a few days, so on Monday, I believe Overwatch. I believe Overwatch is playing. Uh, Cod on Wednesdays, Valorant on Wednesdays, Fortnite's on the weekends. Uh, Rocket League, uh, Rocket League's on Monday. There you go. That's what it is. I knew that, guys. I, I, I knew that. I knew that very well. Uh, thank you for all the follows in the most recent of weeks and days and stuff like that. Appreciate you all. We'll see you in the next stream. Toodles. Ian plays. Signing off. Smooches. <laughs>